Okay, another quick movie. This will be another quick movie that'll help you with your assignment. Okay, I've got two photographs open here. I've got this uh, Yellowstone picture that I took, a uh, photograph I took from uh, last winter, and then here's another one that I took from last winter. By the way, if you have this maximized, you'll only see one. So what do you do? Well, what I did was, um, there's probably a better way to do this, but I just uh, minimized, or not minimized, just went out of maximize mode, and now I have both images, okay? So I want to do what he did, and I need more than one image. You can see that this Yellowstone is the only layer here. You see my layers? It's my only layer, just this photograph of Yellowstone. And, um, and then I've got this uh, buffalo. So all I'm going to do, and this is really simple, look at this. I'm going to take this buffalo, I get my selection tool, my little black arrow selection tool, my move tool, rather, um, and it's called the move tool. And um, I'm just going to take this, and I'm just going to click and drag and then drop on the other window. And now the buffalo is in this image. And now if you look in my layers window, you see I have that I have on the bottom layer, I have the background, which I can select. The background layer has the landscape. And then on the top layer, I have the um, buffalo, and I can turn that eyeball on, and you see the buffalo. Okay, and I'll just position that. So now the buffalo is on top. I can go to my other, um, my original um, buffalo image and um, close that window. So now I have two, I have two layers. Um, what I'm going to do is I'll just, you know, type some text. So, you know, let's see here. All right, I probably want to get a f smaller font here. Um, 72 inch font, 72 point font, and type yellow stone. Okay, get my move tool and move that into position. If I wanted to, I could um, I could make this font bigger if I wanted to. Let's see here. Get my text tool again. Click and drag, highlight it, and maybe change it to 92. All right. There we go, Yellowstone. All right, and yeah, that looks good. There's some other way I could control T and transform it, and maybe I could stretch it out like that. Okay, that looks good. Maybe even compress it a little bit. All right, hit Enter. That was control T to transform, and then I hit Enter. And you can see in my layers, and I'm going to collapse these so that you can see it a little bit better. Um, I've got three layers here. I've got the word um, Yellowstone, and then I've got the buffalo here. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to drag the layer where the buffalo's on and drag it above the text. So now I've got the background, and then the text, and then the buffalo. All right? And, um,